Hello everybody, welcome to Whiskey Ranch. As you can see, this is a tutorial video of a follow-up tutorial video of Prism Live Studio. I'm going to take this um, a video and break it up in parts. So please, if you subscribe to my channel, please subscribe and go and check out the different parts and um, the tutorials and guides how to use a Prism Live Studio. I've been using Prism Live Studio now for six or seven months. I'm not going back to OBS for the main reason that my audio quality of my microphone sounds so much better. The, the camera utilization is much nicer. There is some bugs and issues with crashes and freezes, but I actually managed to figure out how to solve that. And also, there isn't a bunch of support for mini games if you want to add a game as a scene yet. It's coming in the future. Luckily, with the latest update with Prism Live Studio, they added a remote control feature, so you can control this the the, the, the software from your phone. Wow, very happy about that. I don't need to pay anything. Streamlabs OBS, you guys are too expensive. Also about three uh, OBS, uh, sorry, about Prism Live Studio that I actually do like a lot is because you can multiple platform stream without extra cost. It's free. It's embedded into the software as well. So this is something very neat that i would you guys to consider moving over to prism live studio uh, in the future if obs is just too heavy resource intensive and just costing you a lot of money and you want to go on a cheaper route that actually works really well if you can hear my audio quality isn't bad and this is just because it's built into the software i didn't do much to set it up so let's start off with this tutorial video with the following things So let's talk about the audio, how to set up audio in Prism Live Studio. Let's start with that. All right, so you can see my microphone is armed and it's already listening what I'm doing and obviously projecting my voice. So let's set it up to default. Here we go. So go to back to default. Now you will hear the difference between default um, settings. It's very noisy and so on. So let's say you want to add your microphone. Let's go to these little dots that will say auxiliary microphone or whatever microphone will say a mic. Go to three dots here in the corner. You're going to go to, to properties. You're going to devices. You're going to click. So drop down box, go to your microphone that you desire to use. You're going to click OK. Next step, you're going to this little circle thing. You're going to use that. So arm it and then go to the three dots again filters you're going to add noise gate noise suppression by just plus so it's noise and suppression keep it a stock and that's it that's a quick tutorial how to add audio and make it very simple and moist for you guys to hear if you guys did like this short video and tutorial about how to set up audio in on your microphone sound your mic make your microphone sound so much better in 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 Prism Live Studio, this is how you do it. Um, and if you have any questions further, please hit me up in the description below. I'll see you guys on the next one. Please go and follow me on Twitch. And I'll see you guys live on Twitch whenever I go live. I'm sorry the screaming schedule is a bit weird. But I have Twitter and all these other places. And I'm quite frequently on TikTok as well. So you guys can go and check me out there. And then I'll see you guys on the next video. Adios, amigos.